Oh, hey guys, it's Over41. Welcome back to our toy review. This one is going to be very, very, very fun to review. I just pulled this big bin of pretty much all these awesome ocean animal toys and uh, obviously some um, other uh, mammals and, and, and land animals and stuff like that. And I figured, you said you guys like the uh, ocean animal review bucket reviews so much that I'm going to do another review just for you guys with all this huge bin of just pretty much dinosaur, not dinosaur, good lord. Uh, excuse me, I haven't gotten much sleep. A huge bin of ocean animal toys along with other, you know, other animals as well. So if you guys smash the like button and subscribe, I'll do more big reviews like this and also do more unboxings involving the toys like this. So smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications, and let's get right into the review. Alright guys, so the first thing I'm going to pull out here is the Imaginax Shark. It's an awesome blue little shark from Imaginex. And uh, his tail goes up and down like that. If you push the or spin the wheels on the bottom, his tail, I don't know if you guys can see that, his tail moves back and forth. So that's pretty cool. So technically, if you roll him, his, his tail will move back and forth. This is also another, uh, what is it called? A uh, Another awesome Imaginex uh, sea diving kind of thing. Um, you push this little button right here, it opens up the uh, spot so the guy can get out. It also comes with two pieces that go into the side here and they're actually launchers which is pretty cool. I also reviewed this toy as well. And then you also have a claw in the back that will come out and you can also use the claw to grab ocean animals. So that's really cool especially with the big bucket of ocean animals that I bought from Walmart. It works really good. Um, here we go we have like a little cage for an Imaginex cage with a little uh, diver here. Imagine next diver. We also have a pirate treasure chest, which obviously is ocean, so um, or some ocean, not all ocean, but here's another little deep sea diver from Imagine Next. And I apologize if I'm going so fast. Uh, here is a stingray or a manta ray from Imagine Next, one of the packages. Uh, let's see here. Obviously, let's just get this one done and over with. Okay, this is the uh, thirty dollars shark from Imagine Next. And uh, if you move his wheels, his head does move. So you gotta like, let me show you guys, so you guys don't miss out here. You really got if you roll him. For some reason, it's getting stuck. So something must be wrong. There we go. So yeah, and then this little button right here pushes it and pulls it right up and chops. Next up, guys, we have uh, some land animals. We have a cheetah. Pretty awesome little figure. Oh, I forgot what these guys are called. Oh, it's a manatee. Good thing that Animal Planet puts them right on the, the tail so you can see it. I don't know what it's called. And this is a gazelle. Love the coloration on this guy. Awesome. We have a lion, a male lion, with the you could tell by the, it's a male because of the mane that it has. Pretty cool. Very scary looking too. We have a huge elephant. Look at the size of this elephant. This is awesome. This elephant toy is fantastic. Um, very, very intelligent uh, animal also. Pretty cool. Pretty big too. Got like a little lizard. Just a random little lizard. Almost like a bearded dragon kind of thing. But different coloration. Uh, here's a giraffe with his tongue sticking out. And then we also have a, a, a freaking amazing... Uh, Zebra. Animal Planet makes the coolest toys. Here is a uh, crocodile. I forgot what this is. Oh, this is a McDonald's toy. You push his stomach and it opens right up. I love any kind of reptile. They're my favorite. Here is a uh, crab. I don't know if it's like a Boston crab or not, but it's really bright red and it's really cool. Ah. And here we go. We have a uh, uh, Animal Planet shark, hammerhead. His mouth does work pretty well. Pretty cool. Here's another shark. This is probably a great white. No, a tiger shark. Excuse me. Awesome little tiger shark. And then we also have a seal. Pretty sure this is a... Oh, this is a fur seal. And then we have a walrus. Yes. These are all animal planets that I actually grew up with. These toys. Um, here's a stingray. 
Love the coloration on this guy. Dropped him. Oopsie. Here's a uh, tiger shark, I'm pretty sure. Yep, this is another tiger shark. Believe it or not. Uh, here's an octopus. So I can like eat you. Ah! So pretty cool. And this one actually shoots water. Put water in it, fill it up and it shoots. It's pretty awesome. I'm going to save these big buckets for later. There's two big buckets that you guys probably have already seen, but we're going to review them again because this is a big video. Here's a smaller great white from Animal Planet. Ah, pretty awesome. His mouth does move very well. Scary looking eyes though. Here is a, another great white shark. This one's a little different. This is a Chat Mia one. Chat Mia is a different company. It's like a cheaper toy company, but love the uh, toys they still produce. Very fun for kids and adults like me. Um, this is a sperm whale, right? It is a sperm whale. Look at that. This one also shoots water. Put put uh, water in there and you squeeze it. And you can hear it there. Here's a crocodile I got with a Steve Irwin figure. And Steve Irwin is the reason why I go herping and stuff like that. If you guys go check that out on my main channel, Airborne, A-I-R-B-O-A-R-N-41. Um, it'll be in the top right corner as well. So this is a pretty cool looking crocodile. You can tell it's either a crocodile or an alligator. This is an alligator, my bad. Because of the longer snout, the thicker snout. Uh, here's a catfish. This is also, I don't know, I forgot if this is Animal Planet or not. Let me know in the comments section below. Here's another shark. I love this shark. This one's gorgeous. And let me know in the comments section below. Do you guys think I should keep these animals in the bucket or just dump them all out in the bin? Let me know. Smash the like button. Okay, here is a orca. This one is also Animal Planet. Pretty awesome. I actually did a uh, stop motion animation with these not too long ago. If you want more stop motion animation, smash the like button. Or leave it in the comments section below. Here's another, uh, this is not a sperm whale. I forgot what. This is a Toys R Us whale. This is huge. Um, it also it is a humpback whale. And you can also put water in there and it'll squirt the water right out the top of his nose, which is pretty cool. And we still have a little bit more accessories. So on that one little uh, toy I showed you guys earlier, here are the rockets that go. That click in and you can push the little button and, and shoot them out. There's two of them. Here's the other one right here. Right there. Um, and then some of these pieces are just from the Imagine X place test that I got. So here's another little diver. And then you got the accessories that go with it. You got like a, 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 a harpoon. And then you got some armor. You know, like scuba diving sets. Here is a working harpoon. Pretty sure it works. Oh, there's the button right here. So that's pretty awesome how it could shoot out. You can like you know if they're being attacked by a shark or a crocodile, bam. Okay, here is another uh, part of the Imagine X. We have an, another hammerhead shark. And then we also have a robot shark from Imagine X. And here are the uh, bullets that go inside of the the harpoon or the, the you know like these little pieces right here. You just kind of click them in there and then you can shoot. Let me just kind of aim here. And they shoot right out, so that's pretty awesome. Last, oh well, actually, no, four of those. And here's another scuba diver guy from Imagine X. So and then we also have the huge animal planet, huge animal planet uh, deep sea diving playset. This thing opens right up. I've actually done a review on this. So it's pretty cool. It comes with like a shark cage and stuff. Everything is separate, so it's not full. I have the full set. I have every piece to it. But again, this is uh, just kind of thrown over the ocean animals because I have nowhere else to put it. And I don't want it to get broken. So um, that's pretty cool, though. And this door little over here opens up. It's a pretty cool play set for your kids. Um, now let's get to the bucket. Uh, ocean animal bucket review of the Adventure Force. Um, let me know. Let me know in the comment section below, guys. Should I keep these in the buckets, or should I just dump them all in the bin? Let me know, please. Here, guys, is the smaller bucket of ocean animals. Let me actually just lower the camera down. And the smaller bucket of ocean animals you can actually get for at Walmart for nine ninety seven, and you get forty pieces for nine dollars, or pretty much ten bucks. That is not that bad of a deal at all. And this one right here, the bigger one, which is fifty five pieces, you can get 
for only $14.97. That is not bad, literally, guys. So, most of this was just sharks, but they're so cool looking. So you have a couple of uh, your great white. This is a... Uh, I don't know what that is. It says it, but it's like a great white shark, pretty much. Another weird looking nurse shark there. This one's creepy. Look at that. That's so creepy, but it's pretty awesome. Love the blue. I absolutely love the blue. And then you also got another blue shark here. And then you have the same exact shark twice. So, not that bad of a figure, though. For only nine bucks, not that bad. Here's another, here's a hammerhead, especially if you love ocean animals like I do. Um, this is not a bad place at all for your kids or anything. It doesn't even have to be for your kids. And then you also got another same exact shark that I just pulled out. But then you also got these, guys. It's not just sharks. You get seals. You get an orca or a killer whale. Pretty awesome. You get like baby sharks. Oh, no, don't sing that song. <laughs> baby shark. Anyway, uh, then you also got an octopus. This is for nine dollars, guys. And oh, look at that! You get a dolphin too. Let me pull some of this stuff out. You even get, you even get uh, decorative like coral and stuff like that. Here's some more coral, and then here's some more coral or uh, leaves. Then you got a baby octopus. You got a seahorse. You get a sea turtle. Got some rocks in here. Here's another, oh no, I dropped, oh no. Here's some more coral put together, a rock. You get an awesome starfish. Look at the look at the coloration or the the detail in the starfish. That's amazing. And then you also get, I don't know what else I dropped here. Some more rock, you get like a, a, a clownfish and another starfish. And uh, let's see here. Some, uh, another, oh no, another uh, seahorse, a baby dolphin. Some more rocks, a baby shark, or like a little, it doesn't look like a shark, it looks like a uh, bigger fish, but. And then you also get another starfish, and another, oh, this one's a, a hammerhead shark that's a baby. Pretty cool. And then you also get, look at this, this tiny, tiny little baby crab here. That is so cool. And then you also get another fish as well, so, and some rocks. So, pretty cool. That's just the first bucket, guys. Let's get out of the second bucket, and I hope you guys enjoy this video so far. Before we show you guys the big bucket, look at all that. They fit right back in there for a good storage spot as well. Now, as you guys can see, this one is slightly bigger. Um, I love the, the picture on the front. Let's get right into this. So don't waste your guys' time. Let's just grab a handful here. There we go. You got a big octopus. And then you got uh, another uh, seahorse, an uh, orca without its mouth open, or a killer whale. You got another uh, great white shark here. Another, oh, this looks, like a, this looks like a nurse shark. Tell by the nose. Oh my god, look at this one, guys. This is like a, not a swordfish, but it's a sawfish. Because you can tell by the razor sharp teeth, looks like a saw. This is a sand shark, I'm pretty sure, because of the coloration. Um, let's see here, a hammerhead shark. Believe it or not, guys, I I know a lot about wildlife. Um, here's another uh, uh, another shark. There's a lot of sharks in here, so pretty cool, especially when you you know love as much wildlife as me. So you have the predators, and then you also have the uh, the prey. So and then here's a blue shark. It's literally, literally what it's called, a blue shark. I love the blue sharks. They're absolutely gorgeous. Here's a big hammerhead shark. Different coloration. So the bigger ones, of course, you're gonna the bigger uh, tubs, you obviously get more. Um, so there's another little shark. A bigger sea turtle. And another a uh, seahorse. And then look at this. This is a, uh, I'm pretty sure this is a whale. This is not a shark or a whale. Maybe it's a whale shark. I don't know. I forgot. I know that, that animal though. Um, we also have another octopus. A baby dolphin again. So these are good, really good for animations and stuff like that, guys. So it's really good to pick up, especially because they're really cheap. And then you get so much. And then you also get another blue shark. A, uh, another a baby hammerhead shark. Look at the size of this rock. You get this huge rock. As well. And then you get some more coral. Or some kelp. A dolphin and a killer whale. 
And then you get uh, another uh, sawfish there. This one's a little baby. And then you get more kelp. You get more coral, blue coral. Here's another starfish. This one's yellow, another uh, octopus. Um, a, another hammerhead shark, that's a baby one. A, a bigger dolphin. And then you also get a, a manta ray or a stingray. Very cool, it's like very rubbery. So it can move around very good. Another, I'm pretty sure this is like a whale. Yeah, this is definitely a uh, sperm or a, a whale shark or just a whale in general. This one can shoot air. Cool. Um, another uh, shark. Pretty awesome. Let's dig right here and here's some more. We got some more coral, so this is definitely, whoa! This is definitely, we got some more rocks here too. It's definitely good for like a uh, background scenery kind of thing. If you're doing an animation to make it look really oceany. And uh, here's some more coral. You get another squishy seal here. Let's see what else we got here, guys. Uh, another starfish. And a baby seal. Look at how cute that is. A little baby seal. And then we got another rock. And another sand shark. That almost looks like a regular uh, tilapia or a regular just haddock. Or, uh, uh, not haddock. Uh, what does it call it? Uh, it starts with a C. I forgot. Now here's another crab. Some more coral. And then, oh, look at this. This is a, uh, I call it a dory fish. I forgot what it's actually called. I don't remember off the top of my head. And then here's some more rocks. Pretty cool. And we got three, or I think three more, th yeah, th uh, four more things in here, actually. We have another rock. We have another fish. Another piece of coral and a clownfish. So guys, that was my ocean animal slash uh, pretty much toy animal review. If you guys like this and want more of these kind of videos, smash the like button. It really helps me. And comment in the comment section below what you, uh, what animal you enjoy the most and what was your favorite. So uh, thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to stay awesome, guys. See you guys later.